what's up guys and welcome back to another ASMR video today we're gonna record it right here in my garden so we're gonna record it here outside so you could maybe hear as well the birds as they are singing or maybe some outer noises but I hope that it will be okay because it's the 31st of December and my whole family is already upstairs so I can't really record a video upstairs in my room so uh, yeah today um, I'm doing actually a special video for one of my viewers and his name or her name uh, its name is Aaron B. I don't know if you are a female or male, but I don't really care. That's not important. What is important is that uh, he or she asked me, even though that on the ball that you've been uh, voting in, that you've been voting in, I think that Whisper Ramble won. He or she asked me if I would be able to do some positive affirmations. And well, he also or she also wrote me down there that um, he or she has a really, really hard time, tough times. So it would really help him or her. And so since I always want to help you guys, I decided I'm gonna do it right now and I think uh, I should be able to upload it today as well so here we go today we're gonna do some positive affirmation so chill out and get ready all right first thing first I don't know what has happened or what is going on in your life all right but what I know is whatever it is you know it may be some relationships problems it may be family problems which are also really close to their relationship problems it can be your own mental problem which I also suffered from several times uh, in my past and it also sometimes bounces back but I sort of already have uh, bailed upon my upon my mind uh, this um, like defensive mechanism against it and uh, um, right from what has, what has been happening to me basically right now I'm gonna be speaking right from my heart um, I had this problem where I would just feel horrible for not doing enough or for at least thinking that I'm not doing enough and also I may be, I don't know, doing exercises, I may be working out, I may be studying hard for school, I may be, um, you know, doing stuff like this for, for you guys, which actually makes me super happy. But then at the end of the day, before I go to bed, I would just think if I couldn't use my time better, you know, if I could have done more than, than what I've done, um, if I could have done better, and this issue would just eat me, would just eat me, you know, from the inside over time, because as you, every single night before you go to bed, if you think that just haven't done enough it eats you from the inside 
imagine, even though it may seem there's nothing to learn, it's just me being totally dumb in the dumps. But no, there is always something that you can learn. So whatever the problem is that you are suffering from, you should remember and you shall remember that you are never alone. Alright, I want you to remember this because you really never are alone. You know, right now, you are here with me. I'm here for you. And I did this video for you. For all of you that are suffering from something really hard and really tough in your life. And I've actually, I'm just doing it for you, you know. It's my free time and I just chose to help you. So right now, I'm here with me and even though the video ends, you will never be alone because you are always with yourself. You and yourself are always there with you. So you should keep that in mind as well. You are never alone.
don't make all the cowboy. I at this moment I don't know what his name was, but the video was simply about that it is all right to not have it all figured out. You know because a lot of people would actually argue with you on that that by the age by the age of 19 or 20 24 you should already have it all figured out and you should already know your path your purpose in life so you should know whether you want to be a doctor or lawyer or just a cashier you know whatever um, whatever occupation that may be but you should already have it all figured out and that's a lie because as the old cowboy says you you can never know you can never have it all figured out and it is okay to be 30 to be 40 to be 25 to be 60 or 70 or 19 as I am and not have it all figured out that's all right you know imagine if would have it all figured out already it wouldn't even be fun <laughs> it wouldn't even be fun you know think about it that you would already know all that will eventually happen in the future <laughs> that's crazy right so I want you to ask yourself this right now um, would you like to have it all figured out I don't I wouldn't like to have it all figured out and I think you should stop you should stop worrying about what is about to happen in the future and on the other hand you should start to think about what is happening now and that's also one of the most one of the like most uh, like one of the hardest yeah, that's the word one of the hardest things to actually do in your life because you know when we are caught up with all these social media and all those technologies and it's like everything is super super fast and we can't even catch up with it so we feel like we need to consume more and more information but that's not the way we should live you can't know it all you can't have it all figured out as i said you know what we should do for a moment we should sit down with our arms widely and our chest widely open and we should breathe and we should relax try to focus on the wind around on the birds and just relax and deep breathe as I do It's alright that you get fired 
you know, from a job that you really loved, but maybe that's not what you are supposed to do. You know, that's not the way life made it uh, uh, sort of destined the life for you. All right. It is okay to also be fired from a job that you thought it was secure because it's never 100% secure. <laughs> Trust me. So sometimes it pays off to try and do something that you really have a passion for. It really is worth it to chase your dreams and to just chill out sometimes. You should learn this. Alright. Alright, so now you know that it is alright that things aren't going your way because it will never go only your way. And um, after you, you know, walk up the mountain, you also have to walk down. You know, so you are, you cannot only all the time be stepping and stepping and stepping up. You also have to fall sometimes. And that's the wonderfulness, that's the beauty of life. Balance. You know, balance. That's the most beautiful force of life, I would say. So right now I want you to relax yourself. Alright. Now I'm gonna pluck the bad energy from you. So think about something really good. You know, you are confident. You can do whatever you put your mind to. Alright. You are unique. You don't have it. You don't have to have it all figured out. And it is okay. I want you to look into my eyes right now. And just relax. It's okay.
are healthy. And I want you to remember that you should put yourself first at all times, always. I also want you to remember that whatever it is that is making it hard for you right now, that is really, really tough, that you fail to see a way out, I want you to remember that I'm telling you right from my heart that there is always a way out and you should also remember that it only takes time that's true sometimes it only takes time Bye.